Saturday morning, everybody. We're back on the trail. It's October 28th. Basically, it's my birthday. Actually, tomorrow's my birthday, but we're hiking today. So I'm turning 63. Damn. Pretty cool. So we're up in the Catskills. We are gonna do Indian Head and Twin. I'm hoping. It is a beautiful day, a little chilly, very windy, and we'll see what's gonna happen. So, we're on our way. I'm John, I'm gonna set 63, I'm over the hill, and I'm gonna make it over those mountains. All right, we're at our first trail junction here. We got a blue path, which is going that way. We will be coming from that way. And we are gonna stay on this uh, red, which is the beginning of the Devil's Pass. We're going up this way. It's a little tough today. It's early, so we got a lot of leaves on the ground. And we also have the sun directly right in front of me. It's tough to see here, check this out. that sun it's beaming right at me can't see a thing all right we're at another trail junction here so we did 1.9 miles already so we got a blue trail here and this thing the blue trail here goes up that way heads up to overlook mountain that's another great hike at Echo Lake. There's our stuff. So Echo Lake, it's got a lane to there. That's another three miles up. I think that's going to be a hike in the future. Definitely we're going to do. All right, this is where we branch off. We got Indian Head 2.4 miles, which we're heading, and Twin 3.8. Hoping we can get there. We got an elevation of 1,345 feet to go. Yep. We got an obstacle. Huh. Oh, I ain't gonna go under that. Oh. oh yeah. We got a lot of mud here. Ooh. Ain't this fun. Hey guys, so I just bought a new toy. I'm so excited with this. I bought a, a gimbal image stabilizer for my GoPro. So it keeps everything nice and level. So when I'm walking, I just have this really nice smooth footage. We'll see how it works. You gotta check this out. Yeah, this is the WG2 image stabilizer. It is cool. So no matter where I put my camera and move this thing around, it just stays perfectly where it's supposed to be. Nice. All right, so I bought the WG2 stabilizer, which I'm using right now. So this is our first time trying it out on the trail. I'm gonna to try to shoot probably 95% of the, the hike with this and just see how it works. And then after I look at all my footage and stuff, I'll kind of give a review about it. Whoa, this rock is slippery today. This is one beautiful day today. <laughs> it's just awesome. My birthday's tomorrow. So my plans got all kind of screwed up. The original plan was hike on my birthday, Sunday, head up to the Adirondacks, do a really kick-ass hike up there, spend the night, sleep in the Jeep overnight up there, do another hike. But they're calling for some torrential rain for tomorrow and Monday. So this is my, uh, 63rd happy birthday hike next week we'll do something pretty cool
Looks like we got our first view here. Yes. Woo! Check this out. It doesn't get any better than this. Man. So, if anybody's watching this video and has watched any of my other videos, let me know how this looks. This new stabilizer is supposed to make things really smooth and nice. Sometimes it doesn't stay where it's supposed to stay. <laughs> but, uh, Leave a comment if you think you see a big difference between this video and my other videos. steep oh yeah we got to get way up that but I'm glad we're not going over that very cool junction here very cool so now actually blue trail heads down that way and that would take us back to the car so it's 2.5 miles back to the car but I think we're gonna stay on this red the devil's path and we're gonna keep going up and see if we can uh, get the twin mountain Alright, so I thought about it. It's getting a little late. The sun's kind of going down a little bit. It's dark a little early now. So I figure I play it safe and we're not gonna do a twin. We're gonna bypass it just to play safe and head back. So we'll get on our other blue trail, doing a nice loop back. Another two and a half miles back to the car. And then that'll be it for the day. So I spent a lot of time on the trail here setting up with the, the GoPro and my new uh, gimbal stabilizer. So we were having fun with it. Come on, focus in there. We were having fun with that, but it takes a lot of time. So we got backlogged and took us a little longer than uh, I wanted. So we're gonna buy, it's probably gonna bypass Twin Mountain today. So we got a student nice hike to get back. And then we're gonna relax. Another obstacle. So, it's 
tomorrow for my birthday, I'm heading out to dinner with my son and his wife. There's a place that makes really, really cool, really good chili dogs. I love my chili dogs. I eat pretty healthy. They really don't eat any processed food, any of that stuff, but every once in a while, I got this thing for chili dogs. So we break the rule and it's gonna be good. Junction. Very cool. So we finished the hike here. We got 0.5 miles back to the parking lot. Nice. We made it back. It's successful. Here's our sign out. Make it official. We're out and done. We made it. How awesome is that? What a beautiful day. Got over Lion's Head. Did about six and a half miles. The total altitude gain of 1,628 feet. I would say that's pretty good. So, what a successful day. So, I didn't get to do twin. That was the plan. It was getting late. I spent a little bit too much time setting up with my camera trying to get some really cool shots. So we had a lot of fun today in taking these shots and setting things up. It worked out really well. So I'm done for the day. It is windy, there's a storm coming in. Tomorrow's supposed to be a torrential rain. So we celebrate my birthday really tomorrow. So that's it for me. I'm John, I'm six and three. I'm over the hill and I made it over that mountain again. And don't forget, never stop listening to rock and roll and never stop walking. Oh yeah, and also, also don't forget, smash that, smash that subscribe button. If you like what you see, I know you did. And hit that bell, you gotta hit the bell to so get notifications. Awesome, thank you.